Hello guys, welcome back. Uh, today we're at this pond that's kind of near where I live. Um, I'm gonna be fishing for rainbow trout. I'm pretty sure they recently stocked it. So, yeah, we're gonna do that. Um, I'm on this point of land. There's water around me. So when you're fishing, it's best to try to pick a point of land so you can fish a vast majority of the pond. I have this um, Eagle Claw telescopic rod and I just put this reel on it that I like. It came from a fishing rod that I got for my birthday a couple years ago. So I'm just going to use a worm and chuck it out there and right now the wind is kind of blowing this way so if I'm not getting any bites where I'm casting I'm going to put it on a bobber and let it flow out. So I just put a little piece of worm with a power bait trout niblet, nibble on it and I'm just going to cast it this way. I think it looks like it gets deep right there. Now I wait for a bite. Wow, that's... Stop it, stop. Oh, keep him off fish. Huh? Ah. Rainbow trout. That's the biggest rainbow trout I've caught out of here ever. It's <laughs> really big. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> you love him? You love the fish, Gwen? Look at Gwen's reaction. Hi. Look at the fish, Gwen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to take this home and clean him and cook him. This is the trout now. It's cleaned up. And I just got to get cut the head off, cut the tail off. And now I'm going to put some pepper and garlic salt on and in it. And then... I'm going to fold it up in this paper, and when I'm done with that, I'll be back. Okay, so I preheated the oven to 400 degrees, and I seasoned the fish using garlic, salt, and pepper, putting the pe seasoning on the outside and in the gut pouch. Then I put some butter in the gut pouch, and now... You just need to fold it up. It's hard to do with one hand. And then You use a fork and you poke holes in the bottom so it doesn't get soupy. And then you just put it in the oven for 10 minutes for every inch thick 
the fishes. This is about one and a half inches thick, so I'm gonna put it in for 15 minutes. I will see you guys when it's done. Here's the fish. Decided to eat it with some salad because it's a really little fish. And it smells amazing. And so I'm gonna give it a taste test now. Um, I'm gonna dip the fish I eat in Frank's because I just love Frank's. I put that crap on everything. And, and I'm just gonna scrape a piece off that doesn't have bones. You just peel off the skin and scrape some meat off. Dip it in the Franks. Yep, it tastes like trout, which is great. So I'm gonna eat this now, and I'm probably not gonna film it because watching people eat is gross. And that was my trout kitchen cook. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.